Trucker Rudy here. I just picked up my empty trailer here at our terminal in Steinbach, Manitoba. On my way to Vassar now. Vassar, Manitoba. Go uh, pick up a load of peat moss. And then uh, we'll go to Germantown, Wisconsin, I believe it is. I have to double check my paperwork. Anyways, let me just double check my paperwork here before I say we move on. Yeah, Germantown, Wisconsin. There you go, another short trip. I was really hoping I get me a long trip this week, but ain't happening, so hopefully I can go to Toronto from there. That way I get me some good miles. But, yeah. I had some trailer issues today. Meters, then turn right on 52. Turn left I went to uh, Highway 52 and then slide drive in 200 this meters. Trailer. Construction ahead. The turn right light on didn't 52. work. So uh I have to wait for the shop to come back from lunch time to get that fixed. But, yeah, then at least it didn't take long to get the trailer light fixed, but at least it was in the, in the yard here, so that way we can get it fixed easily. But anyways, the dispatch told me to go uh, pick up another trailer. So I went and looked for that. Right on Grand Street, Highway well, 12. that trailer was sitting in the shop. I couldn't use that one. They gave me a different trailer number. So I went to go look for that one, and that one is in the shop too. And they gave me a different trailer number. Well, guess what? I went and looked at that one. The rails on side, inside the trailer were all bent inwards, like about two inches bent inwards. So I couldn't couldn't use that trailer, you know. Continue on this road for 93 so, kilometers. And I was stuck. I had to wait till they uh, came back from their lunch break to fix this trailer. Yeah, well, that's how it goes sometimes. Sometimes you have good luck and sometimes you don't, I suppose. But anyways, here we are, putting the hammer down, rolling again, so that's good. So, anyways, we'll see you down the road. Well, I am finally getting loaded after about two and a half hours of sitting up here. Which is nothing unusual at this place, but... Uh, uh, today I'm just a little bit tired. I don't know why. Well, that's okay. At least I'm finally getting loaded. Once I'm loaded, hopefully my border crossing will be cleared quickly. Because I'm only like five minutes away from the border. So hopefully that will get cleared soon so I can at least cross the border today. And then I'll be in the U.S. Hopefully I can get at least an hour into the U.S. Well, I could drive later, but yeah, I don't really like driving at night, especially these narrow roads, so we'll see what happens. Well, finally got me loaded. Loading didn't take very long at all. So we'll go over to the Coop gas station just down the road here and we'll wait there, I guess, until our border crossing will be cleared. Uh, it's a slow day today, but... In one kilometer, turn left on Mons Way, Highway 12. The day didn't start out very good. It's like a blue Monday. First of all, I was supposed to only go out at noon. And my trailer had problems and all that. I wasted a lot of time on that. And get here and sit here an hour and three quarters before they start loading me. Gee. Can't win today. No. Oh, I hope tomorrow will be a better day. We're ready! Finally got my load cleared. I am good to cross the border. As you can see it's starting to get dark, but hey, we'll still drive a little bit. I'm gonna try and at least uh, drive for another hour and 15 minutes or something like that. Hopefully I can uh, find me a parking spot up there. And I got me inspected again today at the Roseau border. Got me another DOT inspection, level 2 inspection. 
which I did pass, no problems at all. I was really, really happy about that. Didn't have any problems. So that's a good thing, because two clean inspections in a row again. It's going to give me good points on my record. Well, here I am at a little tiny truck stop. So you can see only a few trucks that can park over here. That way aren't no more trucks either there. Got a little old tractor up here. I guess this is how they do their snow removal. A little tiny bucket like that. But anyways, I'm calling it a day. It's been a super long day for me. All kinds of it just it's just been one of those blue Mondays, as you would say. I think I think that's what you would call it blue Mondays, right? But anyways, that should do it for today. I'm going to go to bed. See you tomorrow at 5 a.m. Thanks for watching.